Hi, I'm Fred van Eewijk. I'm professor of applied statistics at the University of Wageningen, and I'm here this week for the course uh, Genomic Prediction in Plant Breeding. Plant breeding is about trying to identify uh, good parents to create even better offspring. Uh, so the idea is that if you have uh, one parent that is high yielding and another parent that is resistant against certain diseases, you try to combine those properties and when you do that, uh, you hope that when you look at the offspring that the reason for superior offspring is because of the, the fact that they have superior DNA. Well, what we're doing this week is that we're looking at new techniques uh, to predict the phenotype, that is how the plants look like, and we do that on the basis of DNA. Uh, DNA technology has advanced a lot over the last few years, so nowadays it's almost possible to look at all the DNA that is available in an individual plant. And from all that DNA we try to predict how the plant will grow and how it will look like. This of course is a heavily statistical subject, and what we're trying to do is we're trying to teach plant breeders how to interpret, let's say, and how to work with all the DNA material to produce those predictions for individual phenotypes. And the idea is, of course, that you can, well, uh, speed up the breeding process because instead of having to grow plants to find out how they look like, you only have to look at the DNA. And so the whole of the creation of new varieties becomes faster. And with that, uh, we're able to solve problems with respect to well, higher yielding varieties, more tolerant varieties, varieties that are adapted to climate change, etc.